we're wild. That took a little bit. So, I don't know how far I am. I thought I could cheat the system. I thought I could skip a bunch of stuff and just go to the end. But it turns out the end is much more convoluted and needs many more things than I expected. Which means I did not reach by using a shortcut. I, in fact, have to do it the longer way. But, I think I know. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's happening again. Every time, every time, I plug in the controller, and someone could explain this to me. And it's just as good, maybe no one can explain this to me, unless they're the devs. But if you plug in the controller after the game starts, it inverts, so here's, I'm pushing up, pushing down, and the same thing with the game, I push up, I go backwards, I push down, go forwards, push up, I look down, push down, I look up. It inverts it if you plug the controller in after the game starts. I know you're not supposed to do that, but it's interesting that usually it, the controller just doesn't work, but for this, it just inverts the sticks. Not very helpful. <laughs> I'm being completely serious. Uh, all right, so I just need to reopen the game. Great start. Great start to today's stream. Yes, I know how to wiles is best experience with the game pad. All right. So let me lay out the plans for you. We're gonna. As the name of the stream suggests, I'm going to try finishing the game today. In two hours. I am not going over. Well, I guess an hour and a half now. I am not going over. I am going to stream the game that I promised I'm going to stream, a.k.a. Valheim, which I did not stream. I thought I didn't have shoes for a moment. That I did not stream last time because I got so distracted by this game. But I feel bad now. Because, I, A, I really like Valheim. B, I feel it's rude if I don't do it. <laughs> and, like, people could be like, well, whatever. This doesn't matter. Rude people. Okay. Number 12. Now, I need your ship log. <laughs> Rumor mode. Rumor mode. Okay, 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 okay. Know my mines? No, 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 no. Ash Twin Project? Hanging City? my notes on the... My... Did I not make any notes from the time I was there? Am I gonna have to do this manually? You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, we might be getting. Okay. Oh, Alright, I guess we have to do it manually. Are we still... Does it not go until I... That's not good, that's not good. There's a planet in between me and there. We're gonna hit? We're gonna hit? Okay, go, go, go. That's exactly where I want to go. Okay. We're gonna do this. Uh, <laughs> right. It's still crazy to me that the game actually has... Every, I, I'd love to know how they did it. I'd love to know how they actually make the game render everything. All these planets. Oh, last time too, I tried a shortcut, and then I've almost lost everything. Oh no, oh no. The Pillar of Salt is coming. The Pillar of Salt is coming. Eh, eh. 
Okay, we're good. Where's my light? <laughs> I'm just, I feel like I'm plugged into a high voltage outlet tonight. I say that in the chillest voice I have. Alright. But yeah, how's everyone doing? I hope you all had a good week. Hope everyone had a good time. Oh, this is perfect. Okay. To reach the shelter site, walk forward until you meet the sandfall. At the pit, then turn left. Continue to the room filled with rock column formations and climb upward through the opening above them. Sand here is rising, so you must be continuous and sh Okay. Left. At the sand pillar. Then hole. And then we rise. The fire rises. Okay. Okay. I'm following. I think this is it. I think I'm going the right way. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What does this say? Be cautious crossing the chasm ahead. The bridge Malori and I crafted will do its job, but it isn't strong. On the far side, look for the tunnel hidden behind the falling sand. Follow it. And you'll reach the shelter site. Okay, okay. Perfect. Oh, oh. It's hidden, hidden. Oh. Come in. Hello? Hello. Welcome. Are you streaming? Yes. Hey, stream. Hello. Is for anyone I know on? Uh, I don't know. Here, let me... Oh! Uh, Matthew is here. <gasps> Hi, He's Matthew. Red Red Rose. Here, let me see. I feel like he's one of your like loyal followers. Yeah, he is. He's awesome. He's oh, Cam's here. Cam. Cam. I spent most of the beginning of the stream today fixing the the stream setup because I oh. I messed it all up. <laughs> oh. So. That's fine. Okay, wait. Where am I going? I'm trying to find the center of the universe in this game. It was so weird being at <laughs> high school again. <laughs> was it your first time going back? Yeah. <laughs> And it's like, it was weird because like all the little middle schoolers are grown up, and then the juniors are all like, "We're seniors now." <laughs> they're like, like literally five year olds. So they think they're like the the bosses. Yeah, they lost the game. Aww. <laughs> but the girls won their first game. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's all. Wait. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, like, it's hard because their tallest player is like five seven. Hmm. So like they lost like a lot of fight when me and my class graduated. Oh, Tasha said hello or Candiara. <laughs> we are watching on the big TV. So you're on their in their living room. Oh, that's fun. Oh. I'm famous on someone's TV. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, the door closed. Okay, so ho hopefully. But yeah, so other than that, it was fun. Yeah. I don't, I don't, yeah. It was interesting. <laughs> yeah. And it was weird because some of the, like, my guy friends who, like, uh, wouldn't talk to me by the end of the year were all like, all right, like, they're all friendly. I'm like, mm. Mm, okay. <laughs> okay. But, that was nice. Yeah. I saw Lyra, and so we're going to hang out soon. So she's like my bestie. Are you? Oh. So, like, are you doing that today? Or? No, 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 oh, no. Okay. Uh, that would be Friday, I think. Because I know you were mentioning that you might, might do something like that today. Right. Yeah, I was thinking, but it's late, and not really, but like, it feels late. I'm tired. Yeah. No, that makes sense. But what's the premise of this game? So you're just exploring space, but then you start discovering that an old civilization used to live here before you and they almost found the center of the universe and it happens to be in your solar system uh -huh. so then you're like oh man what were they looking for uh oh sand is filling up like oh. pretty much it's actually really cool because it really feels like you're the one kind of finding these things and i have to get there before the sand fills up <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. and like it does a, a bunch of stuff with like oh no you gotta keep does a lot of stuff like quantum physics and stuff like that, which honestly I don't get some of it, 
and it just makes me curious. Every time I play a game that has quantum stuff in it, I'm like, I want to learn more about it, but I, I never do. <laughs> I'm gonna go change the All right. Have fun. Thank you. Have a good night. Hi. Oh, everyone's watching today. I'm happy. I'm glad. <clears throat> so you all got to meet my sister, kinda. It's funny. It's kind of like we all feel like siblings here. It's not in a weird way or anything, it's just like, oh. <laughs> Can I just... Oh, oh. Gravity zero here? Why? There's nothing here. Oh, quantum stuff. <laughs> if you don't see warp core, wait. That's cool. Insert. Let's put another black one. Okay, it's unstable like that. Remove warp core. Oh. So I have one that has a black one. What if I put an empty one? feels like there's something there but yeah how is everyone how are you john andy tasha everyone having a good day everyone enjoying their time doing their weekend finally the only thing i didn't put in the room is two whites so that works one white and one black works that's playing the you figured something out music <laughs> so and Erica, how is BB? Oh, oh no, this is not what I need. <laughs> Got excited. Ooh, just clean today, awesome. Records show Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the White Hole Station. Raimi and I are devising an experiment to test if this is real phenomena or simple machine. Okay. In theory, what we want is to try to reproduce a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting the white hole. A negative so they want to go back in time to save themselves to save the whole crew initial things first our experiment will set up first a pair of small black hole cores with a small white hole to mimic the setup of the white hole station hypothesis this is possible for an object to exit the white hole before entering the corresponding we just cleaned today andy playing start Ooh, it's a good one Stardew's a good one. I f How do I... I felt like... I have a hard time. I'm s It's interesting, because I'm still learning what type of games I really like to play. And I loved Stardew for a while I played, but then I started finding it kind of like it didn't quite have enough... ...goals for me. Like, it wasn't structured enough. Despite liking it, I was like, eh. I feel like it just didn't catch me, but now I'm realizing that I, I like things that are a little bit more structured. 
Uh, okay, Raimi, an update. Our experiment here reproduces the anomaly in arriving and departure times, but Pi is unconvinced it's more than an equipment error. I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eyes. To that end, we've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City City's energy supply should prove sufficient. Of note, Raimi. Yarrow requests that we let him know before we reroute energy to the experiment. All available energy has been rerouted from the city to our experiment. Remy and I are about to run a new test. Hypothesis confirmed. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it. I saw hypothesis. Ooh, this is exciting. It's beyond extraordinary. This changes everything. What a beautiful day for the intersection of abstract theory and practical application. I hate to leave him. So we're rerouting. We're gonna do the same thing. We're rerouting all the power to this thing. <laughs> hey, Tushku. It's because you're getting older, Rods. What? What does that mean? Ah! <laughs> out before it goes in it's crazy that is crazy game keeps blowing my mind the southern observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible that is to have something arrive 20 minute 22 minutes before it actually sent through the warp we've learned the negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. Creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, but we're currently unable to generate the necessary energy. The energy is currently unavailable, you say? You're a gas pie. My pun was unintended, Remy, so I believe it's you who are, who's aeriform. I don't understand comedy. This game's create. Remy and I believe it would be necessary to invent a new method of producing energy. Thrilling but enormous undertaking. We would also require advanced warp technology able to handle such energy. We would also likely need an enormous space to fit these proposed new energy and warp technologies together. The only location larger than that would be Ash Twin. Aren't we on Ash Twin right now? Isn't that where we are? Oh, that's where we are. Why not? <gasps> I'm on Ember Twin. Oh. <laughs> oh no. The Ash Twin project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically, to build it. We need a way to travel quickly between Ash Twin and each locate can locates. Hmm. Are there a type of cake that's called low cakes? Can I, I know we have pound cakes. And I know there are other types of cakes, like short cakes. Are there low cakes? Short cakes and low cakes could be cousins. We need a way to travel quickly between the Ash Twin and each other location that holds... Uh, what if we use warp towers, like the one we have... <gasps> That's what we have above! It's a warp tower! Connect Ash Twin directly to each other critical location. Of note, each tower of Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. We can design each tower to visually reflect its warp destination. The giant steep tower for us could resemble a cyclone. And we could model the timber hearth as a geyser mountain. My gratitude to those who noted my impressive language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. I believe has been sufficiently... <laughs> uh... Poke, Root, and I can begin work on this immediately in the Black Hole Forge. Boo! We don't want to become famous. Get him out of here. Is anyone here? Uh... 
Is anyone here uh, a mod? <laughs> Did I mod anyone? <laughs> That's what that's doing. Okay. So. I don't think I can do it from my, from my stream chat thing. Can I do it? There we go. Yeah, please no ads and stuff <laughs> in chat. Thank you. Now I don't know how to close this. We don't know how to work Twitch. And there we go. Uh, all right. Okay, so I need to find these towers. I'm guessing this is for the Ash Twin and the... So they're gonna try generating power in the Ash Twin. So I need to go to the Ash Twin to try to find it. Okay. So what I was looking for wasn't here, but it's in the Ash... Wait, so is this plant is filling with sand and the Ash Twin is becoming smaller. <gasps> so I had to... I have to wait later into the cycle for me to be able to land on the Ash Twin. Because otherwise I can't land on the Ash Twin because I'll just not be able to see it. So I need to get to the power core of the Ash Twin. We're fine. This planet, my ship is not going to blow up. Okay, I need to find the power core of the Ash Twin. Okay. My guess... My... Theory, one might say, is that it's probably on one of these power towers. Towers of power. Isn't there something called Tower of Power? I feel like that's the thing. Oh, I forgot to read people. Okay, um, I didn't expect that. <laughs> um, oh, what's at the top of this? Maybe an entrance at the top? Yes, yes. No, this is an exit. Okay, I need to go to the other side. Yeah, that's an exit. Go here, we go. Oh, wait, that's also an exit. So, these both work as exits. We need to find the one that's <sighs> Giants Deep. This one is. I need to find the one that's for the two planets. There it is. This one. This is the one I need can't put the ship in the middle. Okay, I'm gonna have to be quick. Let me see where it meets up on the other side. Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't. Okay. 
Okay. Let's do... Okay. I'll, I'll put it underneath the bridge. That's a, that's a smart move. Why am I stuck? What am I stuck on? What am I stuck? <laughs> yeah, hopefully if I'm stuck on something. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, buddy. What were you missing? I need to find a way to get to the center. So it doesn't have... It keeps getting lower and lower and lower, so my guess is I shouldn't be trying to go to the higher point, I should be trying to get to the lower point. Which in this case... is over here. There we go. Um... Whoa. There we go. Here's our first delivery, Yarrow. One warp core fresh from the Black Hole Forge. Root is installing the core siblings in the Brittle Hollow as I write this. My gra my, blah, blah, blah. my gratitude, Clary. With this, the Ash Twin Project is underway. I confess, I'm deeply curious about what you and Poke found on the White Hollow Station that started this project. White Hole Station. And visit some time to learn more. I recommend you do. The White Hole Station is a model for the towers being built for the Ash Twin Project. So a visit to the station would be doubly useful. Now this is actually really interesting just because this is... You can see the narrative in this where it kind of builds nicely. It's not just, oh, everything's just plopped down to you. Everything's just ready where a lot of games that put you in a post quote unquote post apocalyptic like for a civilization say bioshock or whatever you don't see the development like this you don't see them use something that was already there to build the next thing it's usually just plopped there for you it's like okay this is everything that happened and now you're here and despite this all happening you can still see them discovering things and being like whoa and that's the crazy thing, this is all years and years in the past, but you're still discovering. Granted, they found a way to travel back in the past. They might have been able to do something, but the ship is still there, but it might not be. Okay, stop using this scroll wall to flirt with my sister in, a rom in romantic manners. Her density rivals a neuron, neutron star. Ooh! And go to meet her in the White Hole Station. I wish I could wait here for you to arrive, but... The forge and my unfinished work there is calling. I'll return more material soon. Always look behind. Ship log updated. Your base are good. Woohoo! I don't remember. And this m might be the lowest point. As long as the Ash Twin isn't... I mean, the, the other twin isn't gonna go crazy and kill me. Oh, there's so many of them dead here. Oh, you know what? Some of the... This project may not have worked. They might have died. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I need to go fast. Ooh. Erica, thank you for the... For the host. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Here. This is terrifying. By, 
the way, the Ash Twin Project stuff actually... This is cool. Actually corroborates what we were talking about earlier in the stream, or previously in the stream, where we, we were hypothesizing that uh, it could be that I'm not actually going back into the past, but I was... Uh, oh! Oh! I found it! I found it! Never mind. I don't need to go there. <laughs> I just needed to wait for it to drain. Okay, okay. Here we go. No! 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 <laughs> oh! This makes me think that the cycle is going to end soon. Meaning... Oh, oh, no. No, no. Okay, let's bring it back here. The sun might explode soon, as we, as we would expect. Okay, so this, ow, this is the tower. Okay, it's playing the music of, yeah, you figured something out, but I, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't yet, oh. Oh wow, this is underneath the whole station. That's cool. Please don't blow up, son. I, I still need to find mo out more. No! I need to find out more. What kind of sorbet, by the way? What flavor? Wait, 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 wait. It's dark. The sun's gonna blow up. <laughs> no, it's too soon. It's too soon. I didn't figure everything out yet. It's too soon. black hole. How do I do that? <laughs> All I hear is too soon. <laughs> it's... I know what I have to do. Okay, so for everyone who wasn't here, I have the coordinates to the center of the universe. I have it. I have no way of getting there, except I found their mothership. I found the Nomais, the people that lived here before us. I found their mothership. And... Okay, yeah, we're connecting things. Black Hole Forest District, the highest district in the Hanging City. So is that where I have to go? Am I debate to obtain the powerful highly advanced warp core? Because I need a warp core. So I guess I'm going to... The Hanging City is in the Brittle Hollow. Right? Yeah. I need to connect this. Right? 
I need to go to the Black Hole Forge and do it all. It feels like I'm going in circles now. Because I feel like I have enough information, but every time I say that, I don't have enough. I sound like a crazy person again. This game just makes me sound like a crazy person. Dark Bramble? No. Are the twins? Where is Brittle Hollow? Giant Steep. I thought maybe I saw something behind Giant Steep. There's the thing. The comet. I actually call, called the comet back and checked the ship. Oh, oh, there it is. So, I found a way, I found a ship that is able to take me to the Eye of the Universe. But it, it's out of power. Its power is broken. So I need something that can produce that much power. My thought is that they're being able to pump this much power so, through, like, the Black Hole Forge and stuff like that. So I need to find how they're doing that. No, the good thing is that I, I figured out how to... Ugh. Oh. <laughs> I swear I know how to fly. Ah! Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Where is the Hanging City? It's not this, this is the early... I need to find the Hanging City. This is the Tower of Quantum Tower. <laughs> yes, the Tower of Quantum Tower. I don't think that's it. Oh, I should have put it in the thing. I should have put the hanging city in the thing. Oh, you know what? I think it's in the North Pole. Yeah, there we go. This. I think this is it. I can land here. There we go. Suit. All right, so we're gonna check the Black Hole Forge. Which one is the Black Hole? Black Hole Forge District. Okay, so I'm looking for that one. I guess it's... Bingo. It's upside down. Juice. They're both broken. <sighs> oh, uh oh, oh, I gotta keep moving. Don't drop me, don't drop me, please. Oh. I need to get there. How will I get there? Even the music knows. Even the music knows. The music is like, yes, we are sad for you, Rolls. You can't get up there. You're unable. <laughs> okay, I think my my first attempt. I feel like there's always a right way to do these things. But who's gonna do it the right way? Who's about to do it the right way? Not me. Uh oh. so hard. 
Alright. And I'm, the thing, this whole game is like, it's all about you being, you racing against the, the clock, essentially. Because, oh, actually, this is fine. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I think it's I'm, I'm somewhere where the game does not want me to be. No, 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 no. Okay. The game definitely does not want me to be here. Maybe I can sit on that outer wall. <sighs> okay. Okay. This isn't the way. This is not the way. Do this. Where's my ship? Where is my ship? It's one level lower. Ow. I'm okay. Okay. If you can't fit in a tiny hole, just force your way through, said no one. Oh. Oh, what's this? What is, oh. I think this is the Black Hole Forge. Okay. Why can't I push myself up? Oh, it's because I'm pressing the match velocity button. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. This. Come on, stop spinning! <laughs> it's gonna make everyone dizzy. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is... This is okay. I'm on the other side now. What does this say? Black Hole Forge Controls! Yes! Okay, 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 okay. That's the thing I need. Right there. That's how they're getting the energy from the black hole. That's genius. Obviously, I don't know if that would work in real life, but, like... <laughs> At least in something like this, that's really cool. Okay. I need to figure- okay, maybe I should read. Reading solves many things. Kids, don't forget to read. Ash Twin Party requires a powerful, highly advanced warp core. How should we ob obtain it? Anyone have the answer? Ooh. Here we go. We could craft a new advanced warp core inspired by the vessel's warp. Yes! This is exactly what I. The greatest challenge here, I think, is we don't have a design for such a powerful core or any of the original crafters for the vessel's core. No, but Poke was an apprentice to Anona, who created the original design. And our Black Hole Forge is adept at crafting simpler cores. I believe I can be of use here. The vessel's warp core was created before my time, but Anona explained many of his designs to me. I thought Anona was a girl. 
Abandoning the vessel's warp core and its casing means losing valuable knowledge. This is true, however, it's knowledge we have little hope of recovering. It would be the best to relearn, I think. It would be very much... Okay. I would very much like to craft such a powerful core. More relevantly, I believe the Black Hole Forge crew and I would be able to recreate the basic design. This is the safest path... Yes! And... I got to this conclusion. I got to the conclusion that we need to get... When you, you get satisfaction, because it's... Wait, are we zero-G now? No, we're not. No, we're not. Okay, ship. Ship. Oh, I keep pressing A. I don't know why I keep pressing A. Wait a minute. I think I did it. <laughs> I go forge. I can't believe I pulled it off. I didn't think it would stick to the ceiling, but I, I guess it did. Do I have time in this cycle, though? It must have. I don't have time on this cycle. I'm gonna be really mad. Oh. Hello. Regarding the warp towers of Ash Twin, does each tower have to be perfectly aligned with the center of the astral body, which it is tuned? I enjoy precision as much as the next Nomai, but if, for example, the tower's base were to shift even slightly, that tower might be no longer aligned with the, its astral body. More accurately, I enjoy precision as much as the next Nomai, Provided the next Nomai is not poke. Uh, we don't need the alignment angle to be exact. It only needs to be within the 5 degree of the astral body center. Ugh. Of note, this gives us slightly longer warp window. I imagine this window will last roughly several seconds. As much as any Nomai stepping into the warp platform during... As such, any Nomai... Blah, 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 window will be immediately warped. We will need to be careful around the platform for the duration of the time and it's active to avoid accidental tra I mean transportation. Okay. Where, where am I taking this first black hole core and where am I taking the remaining cores once they are ready? White hole cores are for the warp receivers each of the six receivers are being constructed at different locations, so those deliveries will be greater pain in your cervical spine. Uh, the tower designs in the high energy lab on the Ember Twin reveal the receiver's location. Ask Yarrow. He is familiar with them. All of the warp towers are being constructed on Ash Twin, so black hole cores will go there. My gratitude. In that case, poke Clary, and I'm leaving for I'm leaving for delivery. I'll send Yarrow your regards. Poke, I'll return to the forge shortly. I'm going to catch up to the root and help him deliver the first core to Ash Twin. Make sure that Yarrow receives it. Of course you are. So many dead. this scrolly scroll then drop it and pick up this scrolly scroll then drop it and then pick up the other scrolly scroll and put it in the hole then beat it. that's the gameplay loop of this game <laughs> of note yarrow believes he spotted a flaw in the warp tower designs namely that one of the warp towers in ash twin will never activate because its warp receiver will never align overhead there's your romantic interest think a warp tower's alignment point is its receiver? D does he not know that warp tower always aligns with the center of its corresponding astral body? That isn't an unreasonable belief given the receiver does have be located on or in close orbit around the relevant astral body. I seem to recall that was your understanding of warp technology at first. 
No, Yarrow understands the distinction. He likely doesn't realize the Hourglass Twins are so close together they function as a single astral body with a shared alignment point in between them. Oh. Also, look at that chin definition. Uh, okay. So all I need... What is this sending up? Did this go? Oh. oh. Really, you guys can build stairs? <laughs> this is just for this. <laughs> okay. Also this. <gasps> BB's talking. Is it first talking? BB. Wait a minute. This is where it came through. I forgot. I need to go to the bottom. There's nothing here. We're rotating, I get that. Is that pointing? <laughs> this is a nice place to live. It is a nice, imagine living here and you get to watch a black hole. This would actually be really cool. I wish I lived here, but these snooty looking aliens are the ones who live here. They look like, they look so pleased with themselves in these statues. They're like, cool. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Yes, I created a black hole system. Yeah. Alright, so... <laughs> no, they... Don't worry, they all died like 10,000 years ago. <laughs> don't worry about them. They be dead. <laughs> um, so... Yep. I thought this might happen. Uh oh, uh oh. I don't have any way to control myself. No! This is ground control to Trader Joe's. I don't want to buy food. Right. Where is the white hole thing? never considered this, I could explore these places after they've been launched into space. Dr. Seuss, it seems. I can't make two kilometers. Oh, there's the station. Is that the station? I don't know if that's the station. It is free real estate. 
A lot of this universe is free real estate. I like the silence and just hearing me breathing. It's very accurate to space. It shows you that the system is actually really small. It's like a few kilometers across a very small star, which makes it kind of an impossible star. It's not feasibly possible for a star to be that small in, in that stage of its life. Right before going supernova, right? Or is it exactly when it would, it would be possible because... Because I thought, I thought that old stars expand, like the older a star gets it, it becomes bigger. So it would be impossible for such an old star that's about to go supernova to... <laughs> ooh, ooh. The, a diagram depicting, depicting the alignment angle of the warp tower and its corresponding astral body. Warp tower alignment angles are not exact, only need to be within 5 degrees. Okay, the results in slightly longer warp window. Why do they all die right after warping? The warp tower's alignment point is not its warp receiver, but rather a warp tower always aligns with the center of its cor corresponding astral body. The warp receiver must be located on, close to orbit around the relevant astral body. The hourglass twins are so close together. Where is I just need a warp core. I need a warp core. Oh, I'm falling back. <laughs> yeah, BB. BB, show them who's boss. BB's boss. Accelerating towards destination. Alright. Okay. Oh. Spin me around. Ooh. 
Hope no one has any motion sickness. Actually getting good at this. Ow, ow. <laughs> Don't take it back. I'm I'm still okay. I thought that was a butterfly. It's oh, oh, oh. Getting a little bit too close. Okay. Well, let me check this out. No! Oh, this is a different one. I don't remember that warp tower. crazy to me how everything, like, they had to program everything to keep running perfectly, so nothing's gonna hit each other. Uh, except me, I might hit things. No, oh, it's pulling me into the sun! Okay. Um. Alright, alright. I need to find a hole. In this planet. I know that at this point we should have a hole. We need to find it. Oh, oh, oh that will work. Here we go. So yeah, that's too low, I can't exactly see, so I'm gonna have to go to the controls again. And can we go up, please? Thank you. I guess pushing up against... <laughs> against, uh... Or pulling up away from a... Black hole is probably not very easy. Boop, 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 boop. I need to see if what I'm thinking is true. If at the tip of... Oh! Erica, thank you for the gifts! Thank you for gifting both Impervious and Cam. So, I don't have a saying for a winner, but welcome, Cam. And Michael. Okay, so it's not there. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much, Erica. Very kind of you. No, 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 no. Well, oh. thank you, Erica. Thank you, and welcome, Tasha. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. It was kind of a lost cause, anyway. I'm willing to admit that.
It's okay. It's okay. And I have a little gifty gift present next to your name. You know, despite being on Twitch and knowing certain things, I still don't know how, like, a lot of the little badges and stuff like that look. Now I'm doing little pirouettes and spares. But yeah, thank you so much. It really does mean a lot. So I've never been to that station. It's probably the hardest thing to land. And that is why I would think that it would have something of importance, importance to me. Aww. Thank you. Now who wants to orbit the sun? <laughs> I got a thing. Oh, you guys can't see it. I just got an achievement. <laughs> Die under 60 seconds. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, that's, uh... I feel like a lot of people probably died trying to do this, getting to that station. Because for something to be that hard, this is where a part of game design comes in. When you present a challenge that is incredibly hard, and it's a game like this where you can do anything from the beginning, it feels to me as though it's... it would be something that you... Okay, I need to... Okay, I need to use my speed to maintain course and not crash. See, that's the problem. Uh, the sun. The sun killed me. Uh, I flew into the sun, because I'm trying to get to the, the sun station. I am attempting to get to the sun station. I already have a hard time. I need to know. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll keep that in mind. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Pull up, pull up, pull up. <laughs> so I hope everyone's having a nice Friday. Enjoying a nice drink. This thing that definitely needs a pull up. <laughs> it could be annoying, but if, if maybe there's a mod that does it, I think it would be fun. <laughs> Just telling you, you're going too fast, you're gonna crash and die. 
because the game definitely does have something like that. Like, if, well, not to the sun, but if you, it definitely has a, a speed threshold where it knows that you go a little bit too fast, it'll crash. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm matching speed with the thing. No, 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 no. Come on. No, no. Ah, oh, that's the Ash Twin. I don't. Get out of here, I wanna get in touch with the sun. <laughs> Houston, we have a problem. Our pilot's trying to get close to the sun. Okay. Oh, the sun pulls you in, look at that. Is that a surprise? Probably not. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna have to be way closer to the sun. Uh-oh. No! I thrust her power bone off! <laughs> okay. Okay. There's one other solution. And it's that, probably the solution they want you to use. I can warp to the White Hole Station. From the White Hole Station. To the sun. Oh, it's the moon. The moon, the quantum moon that disappears. if I can ask the thing to yeah it's lost um if I can do the white quantum moon view entries in my brittle hollow observe phantom moon okay I literally have nothing else on that white hole station going there. And we're gonna try landing on the sun through the white hole stage. I 
I am not giving up on landing on the sun. I will land on the sun. No matter what we do. That is my promise. I have 13 minutes. Wait, where, where are you taking me, autopilot? Autopilot was messing with me. Where's the autopilot taking me? Can you not? I just want to go to the white hole station. Accelerating. There we go. There we go. Oh. It's all right. That's all right. There we go. Oh, slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Quantum fluctuations here. like I haven't gotten out of the ship in a while. Don't know why. Oh, you know what? I can walk on the outside of this. wonder if there's anything interesting. I wonder if the two exits take you to a different location? Or if they're, that's what they are. It's two different exits. Yeah. There's two different exits. Alright. So... Haha! They're using that technology. Ember Twin, Projection Stone... Sun. Oh, you know what? I might just. Oh. I might need to get a sun projection stone. Opens and lights, whole station, it fell through back long then don't worry. Every warp tower is tuned to a specific astral body. The tower's warp can only be used during the brief window when the tower is aligned with its corresponding astral body. In this case, Brittle Hollow. Must be standing on a warp platform before during this amount to be. Look, the station is broke. Okay, so this one won't take me. I actually, I'm just gonna exit since my ship's here. I'm not gonna use it. That's no fun. Ow, ow.
actually kind of interesting how this works. This cocoon I'm in is not actually moving at all. What's moving is... Alright, I'm gonna put this here. I'm gonna put this here. I'm gonna put this here. Alright, I'm not putting this anywhere, I'm just gonna start driving. Feels like plant is not earth. Sun. That one. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Next <laughs> camp. Signal locator. Yeah, this is it. Probe tracking module. Still a big ol' question mark. Can increase the negative time interval. Oh, I wanna know. Special design to physically seal off the central chamber. Okay, wait, wait, wait. The know my mind or from this site. To craft a protective shell designed to physically seal off the central chamber inside the Ash Twin. Once the shell was finished, Nomai checked to ensure there were no longer any physical entrances or cracks. Nomai discovered a species of four-eyed semi-aquatic life. Okay. station was used as a model for these towers, which were built for the Ash Twin project. All the Each tower designed to visually reflect towers allowed no one to quickly travel between Ash Twin and all the other locations crucial for the Ash Twin project. for the sun. That's how we're getting to the sun. Alright. Ooh! Engage autopilot. <laughs> we're changing course. gonna send me into the sun autopilot 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 <laughs> okay into the sun I go well now we know autopilot not smart enough to avoid the sun Confirm. <laughs> Here comes the <laughs> Alright. Last expedition and then I'm going to Valheim. Unless I die like right now, and then I'll try again. But <laughs> it throws me into the sun again. So hopefully... 
Hello! How are you doing, Super Pegorino? do anything here. Oh, it hasn't... Uh, oh, I'm pushing the wrong one. It hasn't actually started losing its sand yet. Interesting. I wonder when that starts. I wonder if something specifically triggers it. Ooh, that was pretty smooth. Okay. How's the exploration? It's been pretty good. Oh, 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 oh. I haven't seen this place yet. It's been pretty good. So I discovered... I, I'm s Honestly, I discovered more things, but I'm still trying to do what I was trying to do last stream. Which is find a way to get a warp core. Because I know I need it. I need a warp core. But I don't, just don't know where to get it. Oh. What planet are you? Oh, is that the moon? I want to get a warp core to put it in the the main ship, like the main Nomai ship that's in the in the uh, what's it called in the Bramble. So that I can warp. To the eye of the universe, because I have the coordinates for that. So I'm just looking for a warp core. That's my carryout gal. So I, I've I was able to open this up. I went inside here and I did all the things. Uh, turns out there wasn't anything there. It's on the Ash Twin. But I can't currently get to the Ash Twin, because it's all sand. So I need to wait a while for it to, like, unsandify. Which it started doing. So that I can go to the Shown. Go to the Shown. We're getting... We're getting more here. Anymore. I guess I could sleep somewhere. That could speed up the process. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'm gonna sleep for a little bit here on Ember Twin. I just need to find where my my friend is here. Remember, he's in the canyon -y area. Here we go. Hey, friend. Oh. Hey, friend. How's it going? Perfect landing. Just need to use your bed. Ooh. Okay. I guess I doze off. Why? And the moon? What do you mean the moon? The quantum moon? I threw a probe in there. I, I listened to it with my little radio. That's all I could do. And then I tried to go through it and then it disappeared. I have not heard any more news about the moon other than that. How are we doing? Where is the Amber Twin? Uh, 
think still some more time. Yeah, let's give it some more time. Kind of cool to see its atmosphere around it. That should be enough. Raise my ship. Let's go. I'm going to the sun. Why? I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I haven't been there yet, and it might have something for me. I just need to find the sun tower. Here. This is the sun tower. This is the sun tower. Okay. Can't get in through there. Top of the sun tower quickly. No, oh no. Okay, okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna wait for the this whole thing to to go around once. I don't want to be on top of the sun tower while it's going on top. Hopefully it goes by quickly. I love the atmosphere color. I never noticed it on this planet. Come on. Come on, sand thing. looking at the um <laughs> yeah <laughs> had a feeling okay ooh, ooh, ooh. am I not going up This is good enough. I might not be able to get out of here afterwards just because. Okay, here we go. Some time has passed since I checked in with you, Pi. Are you and Idea progressing? with the sun station plans. Presently, my assessment is that our plan would either fail explosively or su succeed explosively. Pi, you know I don't find that funny. Time spent away from the station would be beneficial for you both. I'm immensely interested in testing your hypothesis, Yarrow. That, at least, we can agree on. How curious Raimi thinks I'm a gas, and I don't recall requesting you monitor for this conversation. I... day, uh... I don't see what state of matter has to do with anything. I don't recall supporting the sun station's construction, but here we are. Okay. So here's a bunch of spiky things that I feel like I have to maneuver through. Ow, ow, ow. So, the sun station just so happens to be incredibly hard to get into. That's good to know. Well, that's actually going to be it for me today. 
I said one more loop before the last loop. That's it. That is it. So I'm gonna move on to Valheim. I haven't played that in a long time. Moving on to Valheim now, and uh, probably be playing that for a little bit longer. Erica, thank you for another gifted sub to Super Pegorino. Thank you so much, and welcome, Super. Welcome to the family, son. That's my... The only quote I can think of right now. But yeah. So, that's gonna be it today for... Even numbers. It's that OCD. For Outer Wilds, I'm gonna go over to... To some... Some Valheim. But yeah, this game continues to surprise me. It's just such a... I really like it. I really like it. This leaves you thinking. Anyway. That's gonna be it for me today. And yes, time for us to play go from playing space to playing Vikings. So just give me a moment. I'll take a couple minute break, quick bathroom break. And I will be back with some Valheim. I'll see you on the other side.